Let's play semental number 140. Nearest word similarity isn't that high of 69, uh, although the tenth nearest doesn't really drop that much to 61. I think that's fairly high. And then the one thousandth is 24. I'll start with the elements air, water, earth, and fire. None of those are very good. We'll do a quick animal, mineral, vegetable. Okay, nothing too exciting yet. I think I'll try again the paired words that I did yesterday and see if that helps us any. Is it um, abstract or is it concrete? Seems to be a little more abstract. Is it thought or feeling? Hmm, not much difference there. Okay, um, let's try organic or inorganic. No? Well, yesterday I got the best result when I did dog versus cat. Not today, of course. Is it um, hello or is it more goodbye? Not much difference there. Is it more here or there? Oh, it's more here. So let's try present versus past. Not much difference there. Um, let's maybe try somewhere versus nowhere. No. Is it place versus space? Mm, neither of those are very good. Well, let's try location versus um, what would the opposite of location be? Uh, well, let's just try nothing. And let's try something. No, neither of those are very good. Is it something natural or unnatural? Slightly more unnatural. How about plastic versus wood? More plastic. Synthetic versus real? Oh, real scores a little better. Doesn't really help me then. Okay, I'm not sure this is such a good method anymore. I'm going to go back to the uh, Roger's categories. So let's try um, being, human, okay, let's try in, with, try quantity, uh, many, or few, first, or last, or order, maybe number one, no, um, time, maybe here refers to time, when, how about now, no, anything to do with change, our causation? No, doesn't seem to be. We tried place and space, maybe a size, shape, color, speed, uh, direction, up versus down, slightly more down. Let's try moving are still. No, let's try matter. Um, thing. Ooh, thing is pretty good. That's the highest so far. Object. 
solid, liquid, uh, maybe gas, plant, uh, we did feeling, let's try feel, our sense, ooh, sense is good, hear, smell, taste, touch, uh, see, sight, Try face, eyes, no. So sense is the highest and thing. How about sensor? Sensible. Sensitive. I have a feeling of deja vu from those words. No, um, let's think about thinking. Think idea, brain, dream, dream isn't bad, imagine, let's try the arts maybe, film, music, art, book, oh book is uh, good, let's follow that and try read, write, Let's try bookish. Library? No. Book. Uh, notebook? Notepad? Dictate? Novel? New? Publish or be damned? No. Okay, let's move on to volition, will, want, need, try, share, give, take, no. Uh, so let's try affections, sentient and moral powers, love, hate, Sympathy, duty, law, uh, pray, saint, church, let's try Bible, no, what could the book be, let's try bookie, oh, 86, let's try bet, Wager, bookmaker, nothing as good as bookie, horse, hopefully we don't have to go through yesterday's horse play, let's try play, let's try sports, there we go, gamble, Gambler, I'm 50 but sports, so let's try sport, sporting, try baseball, football, tennis, hockey, so is it, hmm, is it not a specific sport? Let's try sportsman, player, player, um, sporting. Why did that sporting? Um, pitch, field, court. Ball, throw, so gambler, sports, but we're still in the 20s with the similarity. Shop, odds, 
probability. No. Gambler, let's try gambling. Dice. Games. Poker. Um, backgammon. Chess. Goodness. Badminton. Hearts. Cards. Ooh. Focus. Pocus. There's another word, okay. Hocus. Heist. Bank. Money. Invest. That's a bit of a gamble at times. Trade. Trick. Tread. Trough. Through. I'm out. Um, the over under. The line. Uh, the vig. They always talk about the vig, don't they? Um, casino. Superb owl. No. Final championship. Hmm. Flag. Brag. Stag. Shag. Shaguar. Polar. Bear. Market. Bookmarker. Market. Place. I did place. Uh, place mat. Dish. Uh, spill the tea. Oil spill. Fuel. Oh, I did fire. Um, frame. Paint. Corner. Room. Room to rent. Room to let. Toilet. Flush, royal flush, um, bridge, too far, farthing, dollar, bill, all about the Benjamins, union, city, Blues. Oh, they all did fairly averagely. Um, hanging. Telephone. Sunday. Any given Sunday girl. Heart of glass mirror uh, mirrors on the ceiling pink champagne on ice spirit 
Hotel, California, no, so still sports, gambler, and bookie are our best words. What other sports uh, did I not try yet? Well, I did football, soccer, snooker, pool, billiards, Hmm. Early, hurling, curling, iron, side. Wow. High, low, and in between. Oh my goodness. Um, so we're up to 226 words. I'll go a little further before I ask for a hint. We've gotten through these 226 words fairly quickly. Sports. I did odds, but let's try odd, even, zero, Hundred million spectator stands stadium arena advertising um Online, offline, liner, notes, gamut, gambit, opening, ante, penny, Arcade, a video arcade, invaders, attack, offense, defense, commentate, commentate. Ooh, commentate 330. Television. No. Call. Play by play. Will it recognize it? No. Um, let's try commentator. Ooh, 996. How about the analyst? 938. Commentator. What's another name for a commentator? Caller? No. Um. Oh boy. MC eighty three. I did spectator. Oh, how about a commentary? Nine four three. And just in case it's not sports related, a columnist. Oh. <laughs> All right, that was, um, I don't know, a little scary that maybe I've, I'm have i starting to think like this infernal game. But even though everything we'd had so far seemed to be sports-related, sports gambling, and then I'm thinking of a sports commentator, when I matched on commentary, I thought about somebody who might write 
political commentary in the newspaper. And so I got columnist. Now that's a, a nasty word, I think, for them to choose as the semantical word of the day. Let's take a look at the nearest words, see what they look like. Editor, writer. Yeah, they look pundit. That seems fine. It's just when we got into all those sports words, it really does depend a lot on how you stumble into the top 1000, I think, what direction you think you're going in, and it can be very misleading at times. It's a little scary to see that across all the games I've played, which is 72, I've made over 14,000 guesses. My average is 211, so today's game didn't do anything to help that. Let's try Samantha Jr. Usually do a little better with that. Nearest word again has a similarity of 69, drops to 58, and then 31. Those are pretty good numbers, I think. Let's try our animal, mineral, and vegetable. Animal is the best. Uh, let's just try air. Ooh, that looks good. Water, also good. Earth and fire. Interesting that, well, three of those four did better than animal and fire wasn't too far behind. So let's maybe just try nature. No. Let's try outside. Sky. Clouds. Birds. Insects. Pet. Dog, cat, no. Air and insects, so a uh, fly, a uh, flea, no. Butterfly, ant, spider, no. A uh, yard. Ooh, 537. House? No. Garden? Park? Well, maybe it's yard as in uh, unit of measurement. Let's try some measures. No. Okay, yard. Let's just add the plural. Oh, it's interesting. The plural is higher. Okay. Yardage, even higher. <laughs> That's crazy. Yard arm. Now, I guess I pushed my luck a little bit too far, chanced my arm. Uh, yardage. Oh, well, then golf. No. Hmm. What would, well, let's try mile, no, mileage, yardage. I only think of that in terms of golf. Well, let's try distance, no, inches. Measurement, measure for measure, drop by drop. So yardage, yards, and yard. How about yarn? No. Ball. Oh. <laughs> well. I don't know what to say about that. I'm doing some dumb word association to go from yard to yarn. That made me think of ball of yarn. I did think as I entered it that it could also be a ball in the field of sports and measuring the yardage. But why was golf so low in that case? 
Anyway, let us see the nearest words. But 41 was pretty good. Balls, upfield, downfield, dribbler, dribble, puck, miss, hit, uh, lofted, bobbling, dinked, dribbles. So, yeah, there seems to be a lot of basketball, but then some baseball, nutmeg, some soccer or football as well. Daisy cutter, I mean, that would be golf, right? I suppose it could be uh, baseball too. Sclaft, never heard that word before. And call me. They really do come up with some uh, great words. And then nervelessly. Wow. Some uh, weird words. A rasper, never heard of that. Anyway, um, that really didn't take too long to get uh, both of the puzzles done. So that is Samantha and Samantha Jr. for today. Thanks as always for watching.